studio with News 5. Welcome back. The CFO of Chinese telecoms giant Huawei will face a Canada court for a bail hearing today. Meng Wanzhou, who is the daughter of Huawei's founder, was arrested on Saturday on a request of the U.S. Now, Washington is seeking to extradite her for allegedly violating U.S. sanctions on Iran. Now, that was the same day when U.S. President Donald Trump met with Chinese President Xi Jinping at the G20 summit and brokered a temporary trade war truce. Now, Huawei is the world's largest telecoms equipment provider and the second largest smartphone maker. And the arrest of Huawei's heiress has angered the Chinese government and threatened to disrupt the trade war truce between the U.S. and China. Now, Washington has repeatedly voiced concerns that Huawei remains dangerously close to the Chinese military and the government. Now, Chinese state media has since condemned the arrest, calling it a despicable rogues approach and warning that containing Huawei's expansion is detrimental to China-U.S. ties. Meanwhile, Canada has defended the arrest, denying any political motivation behind it. So what's next for Ms. Meng? Well, if granted bail at the cost of several million dollars and her passport, Meng will be closely monitored as she awaits extradition. But if she fights the extradition, her case could continue for years. Or if she chooses not to fight, she could be back in the U.S. within weeks.